Good morning, everyone. Here is your moment of yes for Wednesday, January 12th. I'm at the airport here in Tampa. Pulling my mask down for a second so that I can do this. Um, but I had a good event here yesterday. Uh, two, two talks in Tampa yesterday. Now uh, flying out to be with the national team for the next three weeks. And at the talk yesterday, the, uh, the CEO of the company, um, I was delivering to ReliaQuest, a online security company. But the CEO was talking to the group about sort of like purpose, mission, values, um, his own personal routine. And he, uh, he, he said, he goes, whenever, you know, people go to conferences, they go to Tony Robbins. He goes, I love those things. I love Tony Robbins. I love all the ideas. He was like, but people take these copious notes and they're in their journals. And he said, how many of those people ever look at those notes again? How many of us ever go back and look at the journals that we took? He said, you know what I call those notes? He goes, I call those notebooks to nowhere. Notebooks to nowhere. He came off stage, I'm like, I'm gonna use that. I like that, notebooks to nowhere. It reminds me of my good friend and mentor, Q Well, who would say, don't mistake transportation for transformation. As far as people who are like, oh, I'm gonna go travel the world and it'll be such a transformative experience. And it can be, but it, it doesn't mean by doing it, it will be. Uh, so I've adapted it to be, uh, don't mistake inspiration for transformation. Right? We can be inspired by things all the time, but it doesn't mean we're transformed by them until we actually uh, change or tweak our behavior because of it. And so that's sort of my message today. If you attended a conference in the last year or so, even further, and you hope you have that notebook, go back and look at that notebook. Look at the ideas that you wrote down then. Think about which of those still resonate with you and what can you do today? What can you do tomorrow to put some of those ideas or behavior to work? Let's change some inspiration and move it into transformation by actually doing something about them. So, or if you're reading something right now, whatever your routine is or whatever your habit, or if you wanna go back and take one of those notebooks to nowhere and actually make it a notebook to somewhere, Let's, let's go back, let's turn that inspiration uh, into transformation, instead of just expecting that if I expose myself to it, I'll be transformed. On Monday we talked about turning consumption into creation. That's what we're doing, right? We, we can consume inspiration, we can consume great ideas, but what do we do about it? So as we stay here in January and are looking to set a good pace for ourselves for 2022, Let's turn some of that inspiration into transformation. Awesome. All right, off to Phoenix, everyone. Have a great day.